So what's up everyone welcome back to another arena video so today we're playing a Kali and we got silver augments none of these actually seem like something I would want um executioner on the other hand is something that I definitely want so we're just gonna take executioner uh gonna go for guardians shroud just because it gives us ability haste health and AP instead of like you know we don't really have um guardians orb would give us 10 more ability haste and 20 more AP but honestly this is just better value because of the health so yeah it's just just on a Kali though if I was a mage probably would go for something else okay um uh, I don't know about this though okay I think I get two there. You don't. I don't think we're. Um, dead. Nice. And, um. I missed that completely. Wait, what? I ah, you're dead. Like, bro, I missed that. So, I played that so bad, not gonna lie. I missed you. I mean, I have, it's been a while since I played Kali. We're gonna go for Source Shoes. Uh, I think Magic Pen is always good on a Kali. Probably for our first item, I kind of want Hextech Gunblade. Um, so, with a Kali, you have, so every time you use your Q, I'll show you guys. So, Q, and then you wanna, like, uh, that, you get your passive, that's an empowered. Um, but the way to use it, I would say is like, if you press E right here, you would get it and then you can dash back to the opponent. So there's ways to use it. There's so many things you can do with a Kali. Um, that's a cool thing about a Kali. She has a high sk uh, skill cap. So just pretty good champion. <laughs> so, um, clothesline and Maokai with witchful thinking. That thing did a thousand damage. It's actually so peeper. Oh, I didn't even get my um, passive. Like that. Okay, I was trying to show you guys, but I think we're... So, Q, E, and then you get the your proc, but you know. Alright, nice. I'm telling you, it's just Executioner definitely hurting. Um, and somehow Briar, even though she didn't buy her items, round we, we win, which is cool, I guess. But let's see who wins. Oh, wait, if, if he knocked, uh, if he, if the Alistair knocked the Tarek into the zone, that would have been probably good. Oh, is, is he gonna do it now? Yeah, there, there you go. See what I mean? It's like so annoying with um, Alice just able to do that. Only on an arena though. So we have Night Harvester. Now I feel like you can't go wrong with Night Harvester. So I'm just going to go ahead and pick up Night Harvester. Just because it's it's something, you know, it's something you would win want on like a Kali. So yeah. Right, we have that. We have uh, an extremely high amount of burst now. And Briar has 1.8 attack speed with Dust Blade. And this is she's just gonna be doing way too much damage. And now we have our old two, so we have like an insane amount of burst. So this should be good. Jinx has 1.3 attack speed. All right, let's try to get this one. Ah, there you go. This is pretty well done, I would say. Um, I try and um. Ah, 
I see I didn't use my E immediately there just because if she tried to get out we could just dash back I think she knew that oh my but like this thing actually hurts like crazy this is actually insane because we don't want to be a squishy you know what I mean we really don't want to be a squishy and um this thing lets us not be a squishy gives us HP ability power and something that we want so I'm gonna go for now Hexta Gunblade is really good I'm just gonna go for this just because it gives us 15% Omni Vamp, 90 ability power, and 45 AD. And 45 AD is actually really, really useful. So, should be pretty good. Um, now, this team is actually kind of spooky to me. Because of the fact that they have tankiness in their kit and AP. Um, both of them work really well with AP. So, we'll see. I think we gotta chill though because this is 20%. Um, she's just immediately gonna use it. I don't wanna. I wanna wait. See what I mean? Holy! Annoying. I tried, but I don't know if um, if she wins that. I'm hoping, and I tried to revive that. So, oh, that's actually really well played. Oh, she missed though. Oh, so close. Actually, super close. Wait, you're. Oh, nice try, nice try. That was actually impressive. That was actually so insane. Um, we have... Ooh, of course we're gonna go for adapt, right? Like, converse this AD into ability power. That's kind of OP, no? Yeah. And now we just need a Lich Bane. <laughs> we're just so set. Okay, I'm scared of my Master E. Master E kind of just... Pre I don't know, I want to really shroud immediately, but... Rat has 23 lifesteal. Oh, Bloodthirster and this nice and blood force interesting my next buy though we get a pretty good spike with um Lich Bane Lich Bane's kind of uh wrong one and I can't move That is so much damage. Holy crap. I didn't expect that much damage, but... I'm telling you, Akali, once you, like, get a few items, she's, like... She hurts. She is so painful to play against. But, yeah. Um, who is still fighting? Jinx and... I think... Yeah, that Jinx wins, though. Because... Yeah, that Alistair just seems better. Like healthier. If that makes sense. He's going for more of a. Like, look at that. That burst was insane. Just because of Shadow Flame. Shadow Flame might be an item. Oh, he has Slap Around. That makes sense. Okay, Slap Around makes sense. He has probably has. Yeah, he has a bunch of AP. I right, here we go. We get Lich Bane. Now this is gonna be so much damage. One, two, three. These three items, and the fact that we have Executioner on top of uh, more AP. Yeah, look at that instant damage. And then if we just like use our entire combo. Yeah, no, we do way too much damage. Right, let's see what we can do here. I'm probably going to go for a Shadow Flame and then finish my build off with either a Prismatic or um, Death Cap. That should be very good. I have Tormentor, Wishful Thinking, Buff Buddies, and Empyrean. Mm, okay. Oh, I lag there. Mm. 
nice. That was great. Like, my damage is absolutely nuts. If I just use my entire kit, everything just gets one-shotted. It's, um... Somewhat balanced, I would say. I guess you gotta hit everything. Not really, though. Like, your R is not a skill shot. It's basically an execute. Dash, that's an execute. So... And your W is just like Shroud is kind of OP if you ask me. Uh, I don't know who wins this. Actually, no, I now do know who wins this. Yeah, I do know who wins this now. Unless. Oh, my guy was or is making plays happen. What if he like goes out of the zone and ults himself? Oh, that's a, that might be a strat bard. Just saying. <laughs> Just saying. I were facing them, by the way. Oh, yeah. We're literally facing them. <laughs> that's, that's funny. Look at that damage. Oh, my God. And the fact that... I mean, I think Bri definitely hurts, too. Alright. Here we go. Maybe I'm, I'm gonna try to one-shot maybe the Bard. He does have some tankiness. They're kind of tanky. Not like in... I mean... Somewhat tanky. I'm just gonna go here. Get this one. Can't move. Alright, there you go. I can't. Literally, I can't move. I'm like stuck. Yeah, I, I literally couldn't move. <laughs> if I had my R there, I would have been able to. But we get an augment here. It's not. It's not that bad since we just lose 25, and it's not. Yeah, still have 75 HP. I like I mean maybe if I just waited but they're like somewhat tanky is the thing so it's like I can't one shot but let's see what augment we get here we get accelerating sorcery circle of death I'm gonna reroll let's see if we get something else your abilities can critically strike you I I think we go for this gain 25% crit chance Yo, that actually seems very, very broken. Hell yes. I'm gonna go for that. And the next round, we buy another Prismatic. We could even just buy a Mage item right now, but I don't. And Briar got Raid Boss. Kind of insane. Oh, we don't even have to fight that. Okay, I kind of want them to be eliminated. What the hell? Why is this guy tanky too? Goliath. Yeah, and this makes him insanely big because he has soul, hard steel, and sanity. No, like they can't, they can't die. They literally won't die. Look at that. I need something to do percentage. I might have to get perplexity actually. Yeah, like look at this. He just traps you and you can't do anything. That's the thing about Yorick. But I, I sh do have Briar with me and Briar should be able to deal with that. Yeah, no way this guy wins. The, the Alistair is just like... Is this the guy with the slap around? He's not. Yeah, he doesn't win. He's dead. There you go. I uh, here we go. We get. Let's see what we can get here. Fulmination or reality fracture. I feel like we just go with reality fracture. Is that a bad item to get? 
We just summon void grubs, right? To fight with us. I don't know what's wrong with that, right? Yeah, it gives us DPS. And the fact that we have so much AP is just... Yeah. I gotta use my shroud more. Just because uh, I become untargetable. They can't literally do much to me. And you can also, like, if you press E in your shroud, and it, it, like, will go to it. Like, I'll show you guys. There's, like, so many things you can do with. Oh, I can't move. I, I couldn't move there. That's stunned. I think you're targeting the wrong one. Raid boss? Yo, raid boss is OP. Like, bro, what is that? Kill him! Okay. Yeah, no, raid boss was absolutely insane there. This thing did 2,000 damage there. Wow, okay. That's actually super, super insane. Um, I'm gonna just go for AP. Because it would convert the AD into... AP, so same thing, literally. I could just let the Void Grubs, like, fight for me. That could be uh, a strat. Like, summon them and just, like, fight, fight for me. So we gotta get rid of Jinx immediately. Oh my god, has Gambler's Blade. That's actually insane. Bro, we actually, we actually hurt. We actually hurt. I thought we like didn't do damage, but we definitely hurt. I just need to like, playing with the uh, raid boss, so like, I can't engage the fight. Early on, but ooh. We, yeah, no, they don't win. I think, yeah, they don't, they don't, they definitely don't win. Yeah, look at that. Yorick, he's actually insane with that raid boss. Um, I don't have enough. I could sell this. I sell boots and that for another prismatic. Flash eater would be good. Mirage blade or tax reduce cooldown. Or we can go for demons king's crown. Like what? Why not? There's like a few more rounds left, so might as well, right? Might as well. This gives us pure stats. I pulled this one. Like, look, a thousand health, thirty-two, like one hundred twenty-four AP. I mean, we are losing a little bit. Of, like, we're not. We actually gained more stats with this. More worth. I just gotta survive. Um. There you go, nice. I just had to survive there. Un until a raid boss was done. Now that a raid boss is done. Wait. Oh, oh, please, please, let me press W. Um, holy crap. I, I tried to Q and use my, I forgot. I could, I could have just healed there, but you know, she wins though. This is definitely hurting though. Yo, go. Please. Please. Um, I don't know if she wins without me though. She does. She's actually insane. Wait, 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 wait. No. I can't see, bro. I can't see because of that. Man, that's actually so annoying because I can't see. Stupid, um... Okay, after using a dash, leap, or teleport. 
So does E count as a dash is my question. I know R does count as a dash, but I, I, I don't know is the thing. I think we just go for this. Yeah, it does. Okay, it does. Okay, we have we have dashes in our kit, so. Full Yorick, okay. I can't even. I literally can't do much. I can't, I can't, like, that is actually. Um, really, I don't know. There's literally nothing I could have done. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed though. If you did hit that like button, subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.